This video is a brief introduction to Office 2007 and it also is going to talk about mixed references here. Excel 2007 works the same as all the others but if you take a look up here you see how you have tabs now. It's a lot different than the 2003. Home is where you start but this shows the formatting, alignment, formatting of the number, a few other things in here where you can filter, sort, and everything like that. Uh, you will adapt uh, to this new system. What I want to talk about is doing the mixed references here. This is a multiplication table which has been done or will be done in class and I'm going to demonstrate it in the 2007. It works the same. Everything has been typed and formatted. I'm going to click inside cell B4. What we want to do here, we only need to create one formula to make this whole thing work. And if we look in here, we would see that the formula in here will be B3 times A4. However, we need to lock in cell addresses so that it goes all the way across. So to begin the formula, it's equal. I click in this cell here. It says B3. We need to lock in the row because it's row 3 that has the number. F4 puts in the dollar sign if you look over here. Okay. Now this is locking in the, the cell column and row. I hit the F4 key again. With the dollar sign there it's only locking in the row which is what we want to do. Now I multiply with the asterisk. I click in the cell to the left A4. Okay, now we press the F4 key again. It's locking in the column and the row, not what we want to do. It's locking in the row. We want to stay in the column. Hit it again. It goes four ways with the references, whether it's relative, locking in column and cell, column and row, just the column or the row. This is the formula. I could click on the checkbox for enter or press the enter key. Make sure I'm in the cell. When I'm dragging to the right, remember that black cross here? Drag over to here. Pause slowly. Now I click and drag down and I let go. Everything is done. If we click in other cells here, you can see how it's saying row 3 times a column. Row 3 times the column. The columns and the rows have changed.